And I'm going to put Zane in there. But he gets to the end because it feels as if I was lied to by him. But I'll get to that later. Hey y'all, what up? It's Brooke here. Woo! So today, I have decided that I, let me find it, am going to be filming a One Direction tag video. I don't know, I just really like One Direction and I'm really in the One Direction mood today. So I thought, hey, why not film this cute little tag video? So... The first time I ever remember hearing about them was when they were on The X Factor, which I was not watching, but my cousin Ashley was, and she's how I found out about them. Okay, see, I have a different ranking system. Um, yeah. Okay, so, oh god, how would I rank them? That's so hard. Oh, that's such a hard thing. I guess it goes Louie. Harry, Liam, Niall, Zayn. I have many favorite songs. Little Things is one of my favorites. But I'm also obsessed with Happily. And Little Black Dress. And Fool's Gold. And Stockholm Syndrome. Let's see, since I've seen them all now. Kids in America was really good. Um, I really liked that one. Or the week they performed with Robbie Williams. Both of those were fantastic. Oh, there's been so many. Um, any of the Sugar Scape interviews are always really good. Um, one of their older interviews that I really like is that one where Sugar Scape interviewed each of them individually and then as a group. That one was really good. It's the one where they asked, um, what do you call a boob? Or what do you call boobs? That one was pretty good. I like that interview a lot. Recent interviews... Uh, the one when they were on Jimmy Kimmel was really good. Um, when they were promoting all their stuff at the very beginning of the whole thing, they did one, I feel like it was with Sugar Escape, I don't remember, but she asked them four different questions, like, they had to answer a question, but they had answered in, like, terms of four, and that was also the interview where Harry said that being female didn't really matter. So yeah, I really like that interview. I don't know, there's so many. I feel like it's rude to just pick one of my favorite interviews. Like, jeez, how do I do that? That's such a hard question. Duh. I am Larry AF. That's not even a joke. I'm not even kidding. I am severely obsessed with Larry. I love Larry. I love the thought of Larry. If it's real, congratulations. If it's not, it has to be. Whether it's anything at the moment, that's questionable. But I'm telling you, back in the day, something was going on between the two of them. I've watched way too many videos, I know. I'm telling you. I like the shirts Harry wears. I think they're cool. But I love the way Louis dresses most of the time. He always looks so fashionable. And he's so pretty. Well, a moment that I mentioned a lot was just recently when they were on tour... Um, there were two guys standing, this is one of my favorite moments, there were two guys standing in the audience and Harry asked them if they were on a date and they said no and Harry said, oh, so you're just pals and they were like, yeah, but as he said that, the guy like reached around and hugged him, so that was an interesting thing, I make jokes about that all the time, um, another moment I really like is when Liam and Louie at that one concert they were at they had the water fight like the very first time Harry ever sang um when he sang when they were singing little things in Columbus Ohio like you know what I'm talking about Louie was so shocked like that was cute um when Harry literally sang little things directly to Louie during one d-day that's another moment I like Recently, when they were on tour and Niall was asking uh, where Louie was and he was in the bathroom, that was funny. When Zayn wore the MTV sweatshirt, holy freaking crap, he looked pretty that night. That's a moment I really enjoy. I guess one of my favorite things that happens is how Louie always picks on Liam. I think it's hilarious and it makes my day. Um, ooh, I like when they mess with Harry when he's um, singing his solo and what makes you beautiful I mean I have many moments I like I can't just pick one like 
Okay, that's a little much to pick one. It has to be Night Changes. Have you seen it? It's so freaking adorable. And the part where Harry is like me and you and then he falls down. Oh my God, it's my favorite thing in the whole wide world. I'm like obsessed with it. I love it. No, I've not met them and no, I've not seen them. But in 96 days, I will be seeing them. I want, that's such a rude question. Obviously for me, it would be Louie. Because Louie's like my babe. He's like my favorite. Like I'm obsessed with Louie. I, I want to do really naughty things to him. Oh, okay. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna say all five of them and then I'm gonna tell you a question after each of them. For Zane, it would be, why haven't you had a talk with Kevin Richardson from the Backstreet Boys yet? I think that would be very helpful and beneficial to you. I wanna ask Louie if he's the big spoon. I wanna ask Harry if I can touch his hair. Oh, I want to ask um, Liam if he's ever thought about, like, writing a book. He is so intellectual and so smart. I kind of want to ask Niall if he'll just give me a hug. I have a couple. Well, the one I like about Harry is, um, it's called Harry Styles dash I'm masculine, I promise. That's one of my favorite videos. It's probably the best video on the entire flipping internet. So you should like go find that video because it's quite entertaining. My other favorite video is Louis Tomlinson. His kidneys are top. Parentheses whistle. It's hilarious. It's literally videos of Louis being Louis, being funny, being sassy. It's like Louis to a T. It's hilarious. It's probably my favorite video. I'm in love with it. It was over a month ago that all this happened. When it first went down, I bawled like a baby. There's that. Am I mad? Yeah, I'm, I was a little mad when it first happened. I was mad because I felt like I was lied to. Because he said he wanted to go off and be a normal 22 year old. But when you've been in one of the biggest boy bands to ever exist for five years, there's no way you can be a normal 22 year old. So calling yourself a normal 22 year old just doesn't work and it pisses me off, frankly. I was also mad that just like two days later he was caught in the studio with Naughty Boy. Um, that kind of made me mad. And then Louie went off on Naughty Boy and I was like, praise Jesus. But I was a little angry. Um, I'm kind of over it. I'm a little mad that he left and he left the boys and they had to pick up the pieces and move on. I'm a little mad that that happened. I'm glad he still says that he has four best friends for life and that he shared some of the greatest years of his entire existence with them. Um, so that's cool, I like that, but otherwise I'm just a little angry that he left to go sing songs by himself. Oh, as always, remember to thumbs up the video and you should hit the subscribe button because more subscribers are always the best. Yay! Um, but yeah, I guess on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I, going to go do